Hey, Lemmy Koopa. How you doing? Delivery for m and Toys. Oh, what, what, what is this? What, why are you giving me this? Oh, sorry, my bad. Wrong thing. Oh, what is... Oh, 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 okay. Whoa, we got a Lemmy Koopa 4-inch right here. Okay, that is... Oh my gosh, thank you, Bowser, so much. No problem, man. It's me, Mario! Wow. Yo, what is up, guys? MNL Toys here with another tour review video, and today we have another 4 inch. We don't get many of these, but today we have the Lemmy Koopa 4 inch. This guy is a very cool one, and I really like it. Super cool. Alright, so we can see his wand, which is awesome, and I really love it. I really love how this figure looks as well, and yeah, he looks very massive in size comparison to the 2.5 inch which we did a tour of you want. Go check that out after this one. So let's look at other figures we have in this wave. So we have Mario, uh, Black Yoshi with the black egg, which is super cool. Fire Luigi with the fire flower. Shy Guy with the wings, which you can make a fly guy. And then obviously we have Lemmy Koopa. I'm so excited to get this guy opened up. This is one I wanted for a while, and I thought I was going to miss out on him, but luckily for me, I was able to find him at Target for $9.99. That's the price of the four inches. You can also find them at Kohl's and uh, some random other stores that just happen to have them. So without further ado, let's open this guy up. Alright, here we have the Lemmy Koopa. Wow, he is such a great feel, man. Just to having the 2.5 inch for so long and then finally getting the 4 inch. I really love it. So yeah, he stands up very tall. People say that he is taller than he should be and he's a little bit out of scale, but... It is cool seeing him big, even if he is out of scale. Uh, to show you a scale comparison, size comparison, here is our 4-inch Ludwig, which we did a video on. So yeah, you can see that Lemmy is um, almost as tall as him. Well, taller with the hair, but uh, yeah, I really like these 4-inch Koopalings. They're very big and very well detailed, which is awesome. So yeah, Lemmy Koopa, this one is a monster. You know, seeing Lemmy, Lemmy Koopa is known for being small, too. And yeah, we have this Lemmy Koopa, uh, like mohawk here but uh yeah so let's look at articulation so we can see here his head moves like this so it moves over i'm sure it spins all the way around too uh yeah which is very cool and then we have his arms which yeah the, they they spin around all the way uh they can pop up like this and then go back down a little bit uh move around and then you could also move just his wrist as well which is cool uh the arms feel a little bit weird movement wise but they do move very well and then also his legs move right here so you can move it like that and then you can also move his feet down so see how it's down like that you can also pop it back up same for this one and then one last part is his tail on the back which i guess uh it doesn't move it looks like it does yeah it spins around a little bit which you can see so yeah lemmy koopa is a cool one to get especially in the four inch scale i really love the four inch koopalings they're so well detailed and all that nice stuff i can't wait to eventually get all the koopalings Alright, well, he's not Lemmy Koopa without his wand, so let's put his wand in. I really like the way these wands are designed, like how you put them in. You really have to jam them in there, but I like that, so they're on nice and tight. Yeah, here's Lemmy Koopa with his wand, looking so awesome. Yeah, I just, it just, I appreciate this so much more after having the 2.5 inch for so long. You can just see the size comparisons. Look, look how tiny the 2.5 inch is. Like, this guy, it's like, get out of here, Lemmy. But, uh, yeah. Looks very nice, and yeah, I just, like, this this huge mohawk, it's just, it's just awesome, and his head is so big as well, we have the orange marks on the side, and we have this little piece of hair in the back, which goes yellow, and then gradients over to orange, which is very neat and cool, it does not spin around, it goes a lot to the, to the right side, which is also similar to the Lemmy, but it's m even more on this one, which is cool, this guy is a, is a giant, he is definitely bigger than he's supposed to be, but... I'm not going to complain there. A big Koopaling is a good Koopaling. So, let's put him back next to Ludwig. Now, for 4-inch scale, I have two Koopalings. Uh, there, there is another one, which is Iggy. And then the Larry Koopa is coming out next, which I want to get as well. And yeah, these guys are absolute monsters. They're huge. Like, you saw the size comparison to this tiny little Lemmy. Uh, these guys are big, and it's, it's, it's just so amazing, you know, seeing them so huge. And, yeah, I know I'm, like, obsessing over them, but they're just that awesome. And then here we have our 6-inch Bowser, who actually got me this Lemmy, who is 
yeah, you can see these guys are huge, and this Bowser himself is very big, taking up all that space. And I appreciate all the support that I've been getting on these Koopaling videos. The Icky Koopa video hit 3k views, and the Lemmy 2.5 inch hit 2k views very recently. So I'm so thankful for that. Thank you guys for the support on that. And yeah, Lemmy Koopa, he's just looking at us like that. Now, one, one cool detail is that, like, this Lemmy has a peg at the bottom, and the ball ended up coming out. This one does not have a peg at the bottom, so that's uh, useful information. So we're probably not getting a 4-inch ball, or at least maybe not now. Uh, but I don't see how they're going to do that without the peg at the bottom. I'm trying to get him into the best uh, pose that we can get him in, but, yeah, so cool. Just absolutely amazing. Uh, yeah, you can spin the legs up like that a little bit. I'm trying to, yeah, really find the best positioning. I really wish I can get the Lemmy Ball that comes in the GameStop pack. But, uh, yeah, this is one I look forward to posing a lot and maybe doing some pictures of on my Instagram. Go follow that at MNL Toys. He does lean a little bit backwards, but his tail does help support him upwards, which is good. I'm trying to move his feet in. So, yeah, I guess this is the best position to put him in right here. So, yeah, here is Lemmy Koopa. Let's spin him around. And, yeah, he looks very... This is probably one of the best views of him from, like, right here because his shell, the orange, yellow, and the spikes, it's just so cool. And, yeah, just seeing this mohawk, man, it's, it's so cool. And it's, like, big. It's so, so big, and that's what I really like about it. Very well-sized, and it's, it's just so huge. I keep saying that, but, yeah. This one is a must-get. He is popping out of targets. Um, you don't need to you don't need to buy him for like twenty five dollars online. I found him. It took me a lot of months. That's because I never went to Target. But the time I did come to Target, I did get Lemmy Koopa. So I'm very happy about that. We'll put Lemmy right here. And yeah, very excited to get this one for my collection. So neat and so awesome. Well, that will wrap it up on the Lemmy Koopa four inch tour review. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and comment. Leave your thoughts on the video. Give some recommendations and how you feel about this figure, how you'd rate it. I'd give this one uh, probably like a, a 9.5 out of 10. It's so big. Thank you guys for watching once again, and have an amazing day, you all.